Hey HK fans, James here with a Workbench Wednesday video. Today I've got the HK512 um, that I showcased in a prior on range video um, here on the Workbench for overhaul service. And I thought this would be a great opportunity to showcase how this weapon actually functions because I don't think I've ever seen anybody talk through this before. And um, most people wouldn't realize that this is actually a gas piston operated system instead of um, uh, you know, an inertia system like we've seen from uh, some of the Benelli designs that followed this. Um, and what I mean by that is it uses a gas piston. You can see how large this one is here. Um, and uh, a similar operating system like what uh, H&K has done with their 416 and G36 where gas is diverted through the barrel. If you look here in the bottom of the barrel, let me turn on the light there, you can see those two holes right there at the bottom of the barrel. Um, when a, when the, uh, the cartridge is fired, that expanding gas, some of it's diverted through those two ports, and then they push against the gas piston and push it to the rear. And then what you have is this two-piece operating system. Um, Kind of like a slide like you would see in a uh, pump action shotgun connects um, to this piece here and this effectively is the operating rod that drives the bolt group back to the rear and it connects um, on the front to the bottom of this piece that connects to the bolt and if you look at this closely you probably realize that looks kind of like the locking block on a uh, Beretta M9 or a Walther P38, and it does a similar feature. You can see this is the top of the actual bolt itself, and underneath it, this locking block area fits within it. When it is in the forward position, the lock position, you will notice this uh, portion here at the top, this lever at the top of the bolt moves up and sticks out the top, and that corresponds with this recessed section here at the top of the chamber area of the barrel and that's what locks the bolt group into place uh, when the we weapon's in battery but when the gas piston drives the operating back operating rod back to the rear it takes this locking block area pushes it back to the rear and you'll notice when that happens that that um, lever here at the top recesses down allows the uh, bolt group to go into um, or go into recoil and uh, the eight-step cycle of operation uh, continues. So a really neat um, look inside the HK512 at its gas piston system. Happy to uh, showcase this with you guys. As always, if you're in need of H&K service and support or unique training opportunities, give me a shout. Thanks, guys.